was a hot summer day. A girl named Nova was at the pool with her mom. Both of them were sitting in the shade. Nova, are you sure you don't want to go in the water? Mom, I can't. It's too scary. Nova was afraid of most things, especially water. But she was okay as long as she had her toy dragon Bruno. Mom, please. I just want to go home. Okay, honey. We'll come try again another day. Nova's home was very far from the pool. On the car ride home, Nova clutched onto her dragon tightly as she stared outside the car window. Nova, it's me, Bruno. Your scream is too loud. Nova's toy dragon had turned into a real dragon and was flying beside the car. Bruno, you're real? But how? No time to explain. Come with me. We need your help. Where are we going? We need to go to my home dragonland. Bruno and Nova flew away into the sky to dragonland. Dragonland was a beautiful place filled with gold, silver, and jewelry. It had the most beautiful flowers, and it was very peaceful. Here we are. Wow, it's beautiful. But what seems to be the problem? You see that pond over there? Our secret star fell into the bottom of the pond, and we need the one to help us get it. Without the star, Dragonland will crumble and fall. You want me to help you? But why me? Because only an innocent child can enter the pond. The pond was very shallow, but Nova was still frightened. She couldn't possibly go in by herself. Bruno, who is this young lady? Mom, this is Nova. She's going to help us get the star. I want to help, but I'm too scared. Let me give you some advice. Whenever you get scared, close your eyes and imagine you're in a safe place. Then count to ten and slowly make your way one step at a time. Nova did just that. She closed her eyes and imagined that she was with her mom and toy Bruno. Slowly, Nova went into the lake until she reached the star. Bruno, I found it. Wow! Thanks to Nova, you saved our secret star. Great job, Nova! As they were celebrating, somebody was calling Nova's name in the distance. Wake up! We are home now. Mom, where's Bruno? He's right here. Nova was back in her car. Next to her was her toy dragon Bruno. Mom, I want to try going back to the pool tomorrow. I think I'm brave enough to go in the water by myself now. That's awesome. Let's try again tomorrow. The next day, Nova went to the pool. Before she got in, she closed her eyes, and this time, she imagined being in Dragonland with Bruno. Then she counted to ten, and together they walked into the pool, one step at a time.